YouTube, what's going on, man? She got a test of the review. Never mind the uh, super oily face. I just finished moisturizing my face and my skin. But here we go. Let's get let's get into the video, man. Today I'm reviewing the Bleecker Street by Bond Number no. Nine, and this is my first time putting my nose on it. So I'm gonna let y'all know what I feel about it. Um, I don't have a texture strip because today this is actually gonna be my scent of the day. So I'm gonna be spraying this on skin to uh, test it out and see if this is a full bottle worthy fragrance for me. All right, so right now I'm on Fragrantica. This is the site that I used to read off the main accords and then the notes to get familiar with the fragrance, okay? So for people who are new, this will help both of us. All right, so right now, the main accords on Fragrantica, this is listed as a unisex fragrance. The main accords, you get fruity, woody, ozonic, aromatic, green, earthy, aquatic, mossy, sweet, and fresh. So it's sounding like from the main accords, this is going to be like a green, uh, aqua green and aquatic fragrance. So it's, this is perfect uh, for today because today we're going to have um, 70 degree weather, right? Uh, I mean, I'm in Virginia. I'm not going to say which city because people are crazy. All right. So the top notes, you get violet leaf. Oh, wow. Blueberry. I've never seen blueberry in a fragrance. Uh, I want to say it's cassis and thyme. There, there go your green. Middle notes, you get cedar, jasmine, and cinnamon. Base, you get oak moss, suede, patchouli, amber, vanilla, oak, and caramel. Okay, now. So here we go, man. This is the 10 ml decant that I have for y'all today. Like I say in my previous videos, I'm going to say it now. I have a decant source, very reliable guy, and um, he has a decant business. So if you... Uh, if you're interested in this fragrance or any fragrance, if y'all see me review it with a decant, leave a comment down below and uh, I'll, I'll send you his email information. All right, so let's get this on skin. I'm well moisturized, as you can see, and I want to see what this fragrance is all about. So here we go. We're going to get a test spray on my left wrist. Get two sprays. Okay. In the air, I do get that aquatic feel in here in the air green and i do get i do pick up that blueberry so here we go let's get it to the nose it dry it dry down quite a bit here okay very nice this reminds me of something i really do appreciate the aquatic i don't see anything here that says it they give it an aquatic feel from the nose but i most definitely pick up that time that greenness in here which is not bad if you're a guy who like green fragrances. Really, I'm not the biggest on green fragrances. Um, but it's very nice, fresh. Um, um, like I said, green, fresh. And I do pick up that blueberry, surprisingly. I didn't think that that would be a note that would, I, that would actually stand out in this fragrance, but it do, I will say that. But this is definitely a, just an all-around green fragrance, right? So you get some cassis and thyme in here that gives it that green, some patchouli, violet leaf. So you get like a fresh green fragrance with this one with some aquatic feel. Let me let me get a test, a test uh, spray on my right hand. Make sure that I have um, that coconut butter is out the way. Let's get it. The right hand to see. Not that it's gonna be any different, but I just want another first impression spray. Yeah, that's what you get. You get a green, a fresh green fragrance, right? That's that's basically what you get. Okay, I like it. It's not a bad fragrance. Uh, full bottle worthy? No. Um, like I said, I'm not into the green fragrances really. I'm not into. Uh, all these like thyme and patchouli not the biggest fan of those type of notes it's not a bad fragrance because bond number nine knows how to incorporate everything very well it's nice fresh and aquatic excuse me fresh and green very very well um balanced and the ingredients are very like i want to say they're very like realistic and um authentic that's the word i want to use very nice though man like if you a green guy, if you like if you like green fragrances, this would be something that you would really like for uh, the spring and summer season. But for me, I don't lean towards too many green fragrances. So it's a good it's a good fragrance. If you are into the uh, Bond Number Nine house, this is a good one for you for spring and summer. 
Uh, but as far as for me, it would not be a full bottle worthy fragrance, but that's okay. Not everything is meant to be make the shelf right there. Actually, I need more shelves too. Or I might just give me a big old bookcase. All right, so thank y'all for clicking on the video. Uh, like the video, subscribe, and leave comments. And we'll see y'all next time and next video. Peace.